In this video, we are going to discuss resources to help you troubleshoot issues with Amazon Guard Duty Runtime Monitoring for Amazon EC2. The resources we will discuss today are Capturing Cover Statistics for Visible Coverage of your EC2 Instances and Their Health, Leveraging Amazon EventBridge to Create Notifications Delivered Straight to You to Keep You Up to Date on the Health State of EC2 Instances, Creating a Report to View Amazon Guard Duty Multi-Account and multi-region coverage, and a list of documentation that will help you navigate through troubleshooting steps. When you navigate to Amazon Guard Duty and enable runtime monitoring, you will be able to see a coverage dashboard that has a tab specifically for runtime coverage that you can scope down further to focus on cover statistics, specifically for EC2 instance runtime coverage. On the dashboard, you can visibly see the total number of EC2 instances and the percentage of healthy EC2 instances. Below, we can visibly see there are two healthy and two unhealthy instances. For each instance, you are provided information on the instance ID, account ID, agent management type, coverage status, agent version, the issue that needs troubleshooting, and the last time the status was updated. We can clearly see that both of these instances issues are related to no agent reporting. By selecting the issue, you will be provided with a pop-up and a direct link to the runtime coverage and troubleshooting for Amazon EC2 Instance page where you will be able to gain further insight on the issue. To have cover statistics delivered straight to you, you can create an Amazon event visual to receive a notification when the cover status changes from either unhealthy to healthy or reverse. By default, Guard Duty publishes this in the event bridge bus for your account. Here we can see that we have a notification that one of the instances has changed from healthy to unhealthy and requires more assistance. If you are looking for a way to create a comprehensive list of your Amazon Guard Duty coverage across accounts and across regions, our AWS Samples repository has a script that will allow you to query up to all account and regions and retrieve guard duty coverage. The script will produce a CSV report that lists accounts, region, resource ID, resource type, and coverage dates, and any issues. For documentation on how to tr troubleshoot, there are two guides. First, you have the Amazon Guard Duty Troubleshooting Amazon EC2 Runtime Coverage issue steps that are listed in the AWS documentation. Here we have a table that lists the issue types and the corresponding troubleshooting steps. Currently, there are eight category types, no agent reporting, SSM association creation failed, SSM association update failed, SSM instance association execution failed, VPC endpoint creation failed, shared VPC endpoint deletion failed, and agent not reporting. Second, there is the AWS Security Service Best Practices Guide, where if you navigate to Amazon Guard Duty Best Practices, then to troubleshooting, there is step-by-step -step guidance on how to troubleshoot common issues associated with Amazon Guard Duty. In this video, we walk through a few key resources available to help you troubleshoot issues with Amazon Guard Duty EC2 Runtime Monitoring. Here we have provided a list of those resources that were mentioned throughout this video. Thank you for watching.